getting a really bad feeling about this place. Hey, what's up guys? Uncharted Travel here. I'm just with my two buddies, my buddy Ethan and Andrew. Ethan told us about this uh, random abandoned church that his, buddy, his brother found in the woods, and we're about to go and check it out. drive up this sketchy little path. You can't really see it right now because we turned our lights off. But uh... We don't want to disturb the locals. <laughs> don't want to disturb the locals. After a cold 15 minute trek through the woods, we finally found ourselves in a small clearing which enclosed the abandoned church, a religious pavilion, and a small graveyard. Okay, so we just arrived at this really cool church building. And the guys and I are just looking around. It looks fairly small, but I'm trying to keep the light sheltered because there is people somewhere around here. We don't want to take any chances. But if you just get a look at this building, there's like this almost pavilion church-ish structure here. It's really cool. It goes all the way up, has a nice cross on the top. And here's the front here with the front-ish like balcony. Walking okay, up the front porch steps here. Nice white pickety fence. Okay, so Andrew thought he heard a dog yeah. outside. I'm not sure about that, a, but I heard that too. the dog. Yeah. Okay, well, like one bar. we're gonna try and be quick. It looks like there's an opening right here, so I'm just gonna squeeze through. I just got in this church. You guys have to see this. These old paintings here. Oh my god. Look at that. This is a really old church. They have all these old Catholic paintings and such. And nice stained glass there. Their chairs for when they had their sessions there. Okay. We couldn't find much about the history of the church, who built it, or why it was forgotten. It appeared to have been a Catholic church and had held several masses in its time prior to its abandonment. Now it rests alone in the woods, untouched and unknown to mankind. Look at all their chairs, it looks like religious artifacts and such for their ceremonies. The red cloth, their nice pedestal there, it looks like this is part of an outdoor church and we just boarded up. But they have, it's just like left here. This is amazing. Just go inside, oh my god. This is like the priest's altar right here. I'm getting a really bad feeling about this place. It's like a cracked, cracked window there, but it's nice stained glass. Got the paintings and such, all nice decorations. Still more paintings of Jesus. Feels really unethical <laughs> that we're in an abandoned church right now. But they got even the Last Supper right there. This is just so cool to see. Why would you do that? What, I don't know. I guess uh, maybe when they were, they were closing and opening, they had the drapes there to signify Mass has started. Okay. Well, I think these are the, uh, they'd burn, um, like, oils or scents in there and stuff, and then, uh, they, like, wave it around, and it would, um, it would, like, fumigate the room and stuff and, like, purify everyone. I think that's what they did. But there's a lighter, the bios and stuff. What is that? It's like some sort of rocks. I don't know. Teeth? Like... Has some rocks, I don't know. Like they do some, what is that? Incense. Oh, this all incense. I think it's, yeah, this might all just be incense. I think they'd burn it, I don't know. It's like 
Der kan ikke komme til. I don't know. Yeah, it just leads. It's a out leads out of the church there. A little crack. There's documents, over. There's documents in there. What? Oh, it's not even in English. I don't know what. Yeah, I think it might be Romanian. What are they doing or there? Spanish? I don't know. It looks like they're sacrificing the person. Is this like what is esfinete? Finte, esfinte, es like they're chanting. I think it's just the songs, maybe. The song lyrics. That's probably just the mass and stuff. You're gonna get a nice still of the altar. That's not English Bible either. Yeah. I think it's Romanian. I don't know though. Those are Romanian, or the, those uh, yellow, blue, and red. Yellow, blue, and red everywhere. Yeah, I, I like almost want to look under here. I think that's like here. Oh, under the, the altar. Mm -hmm. That's really bad. <laughs> I think it's just a table, man. Yeah, I think you're. Right. I think it's just a table. Yeah, guys. But yeah, this is so cool. They still have all the chairs here. They have mass. Just all the artwork and stuff. It's it's quite small, but it's so cool. Look at this. Ultimate scene. Assassin's Creed. <laughs> That's Mary and Jesus. Is it? There, yeah. And more and more. All these paintings. Holy crap. Another stone. Yeah, I think that was it. Just Andy. This painting so old and dusty. It almost, this is crazy. It looks like an old painting of Mary and Jesus. But then when you back away, it kind of just looks like another lady. Like a lady just staring at you. Almost like they painted over a painting. I wonder what the painting is underneath. After exploring the building, we concluded that it was a Romanian Catholic church, but even with this piece of information, so many questions still remain unanswered. Who built this church? When was it abandoned? Why did they leave it here? It was really surprising to see that the church was in such good condition and only showed a few signs of weathering on the windows and floorboards given its abandonment. Nonetheless, it was still a very interesting and unique find, with most of the paintings and religious items left intact. This has surely been one of my favorite explorers so far. Hope you guys enjoyed our abandoned church video as much as I did filming it. And uh, if you did enjoy it, please feel free to leave a like, uh, comment, and subscribe. We are approaching 1,000 subscribers, if not have already hit it yet. I'm not sure because this is filmed a little while ago. Thank you so much everyone for all your support and positive feedback and uh, we'd like to give back by doing this 1000 subscriber thank you video in which we're going to be doing a Q&A which will be released sometime in the new year. If you have a comment for us that you'd like us to answer, leave it in the description below and it'll hopefully be featured in the Q&A video. So yeah, catch you guys in the next one. Peace.